Well, normally you could see the other side of the lake. Kind of see the point over here. You ever just sit in your house, sit back? Are you wondering if the fish are biting? Well, stick around and find out. Welcome to Stag on the Line. No sleighs involved here. All on horseback. Woohoo! Windy out there. I'm not gonna lie. Build machine made it, but hopefully let's get set up here. Oh my goodness. She's pretty snowy in the old in the old love shack here. Call it the love shack. Because it's not where you come to make love, but where you love the sport of fishing. Now this is the first time I took out the old love shack here, but we got some like a little cocoon or something. Don't don't mind that. We're just getting her out for the first year. Got a couple of webs, spider webs to clear off. I dragged. I saw that there's a storm coming, but I dragged it out the night before when it was nice and calm, so that I could come out here and see. I just kind of dragged it out into the middle. Into the middle of basically nowhere, it's just a big flat. So, hopefully, we could get something here. I'm not sure what we're gonna catch, but let's see what we could catch in a big storm. Now, first things first, we're gonna try and start a fire here. I'm no survivor, Uncle, but I think we're gonna do pretty good here. Just gonna start off here by grabbing some chunks. I forgot my survival knife. But this filleting knife will do. Don't try this. Really dangerous. Here we go. Ow. I hit my hand. Oh man, I totally forgot to put this in there. 
Save some for later, I guess. <laughs> Found a 516 socket. What are the chances? That's pretty lucky. That's pretty lucky. So I got my fire all done up here. Put the lid on. Now just to light it with the lighter. I forgot my lighter. Nah. <laughs> That's a close one. All right, so I'm not gonna light the fire with the lid open because right now the wind's coming this way out of the fire. So I'll just close that up, maybe I'll we'll peek in there. And I'm just gonna light it through the vent here. I'm gonna close that so it doesn't get sucked up too, too good. Too good. <laughs> Now she should just shoot in like a rocket, straight that way, right in between those two. We got the kindling there. Kind of almost like a smoke. Maybe put the damper down a bit. Close her up. There, she's good. And when you close up the vent and you're unsure of the if the fire will actually go, well, all you gotta do is listen to that little snap, crackle, pop. So now we got the fire going good. I think it's time we uh, we drill some holes and get some fishing done. It's still pretty cold in here. Probably gonna put on the jacket. Before I drill holes. <laughs> well, here's a shack. I usually have a broom to sweep out the stuff, but the dust pan will have to do for now. Oh my gosh, all day, just for that, oh gosh 
darn it. So because fishing's a little slow, I decided to go home and grab one of these rattle reels, spooled it up with some tip of pine and have a 15 pound fluoro leader there with a broken treble hook. Getting dark out. You gotta put a handle here. Can't, can't get in. Here's a shack though. Nice and warm. There are no reports, I repeat, no reports of any fish being caught, but I did have one fish on. And I got it up the hole might count but we're still not eating anything because it, it just came up the hole and it fell off the hook and I went to go grab it but she's getting pretty dark out maybe a bourbon will come in or something maybe I'll have to turn this into a day two I mean come on like the first time you drag out the shack and you get scum no way no way it's not gonna happen not gonna happen. Day two. Well, day two. <laughs> We're all set up. We're jigging already. Got the rattle reel going here. Flasher and jigging hole. I'm using a rattle bait on this side and uh, just a minnow on. Uh, on this side. are frozen so I can't rebait it so I'm sticking this back down here and we're gonna unthaw some bait fish in the shack and I can't catch a fish to save my life <laughs> oh my god <laughs> oh all right we're gonna we're gonna end this we're gonna end this very soon here that's very good though that's like two bites in the last like five minutes today's a good day today's a good day there's one on the rattle reel there's one on the rattle reel Back. 
Lake Winnipeg Greenback. Look at this. <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Finally! Yes! <laughs> What's this? What's this? <laughs> the boys are on a roll! <laughs> oh, we're gonna have to get a close up of this one. <laughs> this thing, Pelican Lake! <laughs> oh, man, that's so funny. What do you say? Uh, she's probably about seven inches. Seven inches, not seven stripers over here. Get back down there. Come back, come back. Oh. You might hit the rattle reel. Oh yeah, you hit the rattle reel. Hit the rattle reel. But it's a pike. I don't know if I should hit him right away. I know he's gonna go for a run. So I'm gonna give him a little bit here. Yeah, it's a pike. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, this is fun. This is fun. Another one for the pan. There we go. This one's a little smaller, about 18 inches. multi-species day <laughs> two pound test two pound fluoro so it's a pretty fun fight oh, we got a, like a 24 incher here awesome okay, here we go fish on just that one come in just had a tap Fish on. <laughs> Vermit Slayers! <laughs> oh man, that's hilarious. Get over here. I'll even let you keep the minnow. Oh no. Wrapped in my line. I'll even let you keep my minnow. Thanks for the fun, buddy. Well, probably like 18, 16 incher. I literally just switched up to like this massive, like ounce and a half tube jig. And literally like three seconds later, just started pounding bottom. Bam, burbot. <laughs> Look at the burbot slayers! <laughs> there you go, like another. This is maybe like a 20 incher. Still a little skinny guy though. Toss him back. Hey, who turned the light? Who forgot to pay for the hydro bill? Well, guys, that's gonna wrap it up for this video. Today probably caught six more fish than I did yesterday. 
that. Oh, don't forget to hit that like button, toss in a subscribe, and uh, we'll see you in the next one. We have a fish. We have a fish in the shack. And I can't catch a fish to save my life. Ah!